why. Why, man? Of all the, of all the games, of all the games you could have chosen to remaster. WHY COULDN'T IT BEEN THIS ONE?! So I find it funny that I wake up today, right? I wake up, I get I get my breakfast, right? And I go on Twitter, and then I see on my phone, Sonic Generations trending on Twitter. And I go and look up even more about it. Sonic Generations Ultimate? Are you kidding me right now? I, 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 I do not understand Sega's concept for greed. I don't, I literally don't understand it. I, I probably will never fathom it um, till the end of my days. And considering the fact that I have surgery tomorrow, and it's, uh, I probably won't be up enough to even try and react to this on a live stream. I can't miss this. I, I, it's, a, it's Sonic. I can't miss. I don't miss, I'm, I don't miss anything it's Sonic. Let's just look at this. Uh, by the way, by the way, we are, uh, by the way, by the by the by, by, by the by. This video is going to go into leaks, by the way. So if you don't want to look at any leaks, um, you don't want to click off the video right now. I do apologize in advance. I just can't understand why Sega, I mean, don't get me, don't get me wrong. Sega Generations. Sega Generations? Is a great game. Like, seriously, like, the fact with all the remastered levels, that was the first time we've ever had remastered levels, but just the remastered levels, the height, the quality, 2D aspect, 2D, 2D elements and 3D elements of the stages and everything, go, like, just the chemistry. Sega's track record of set Sonic remasters, um, let me, to, may I take you back to 2021 just for a second. <laughs> Yeah, that, yeah, that didn't do so hot, so I'm just questioning why they would, see, if they do another remaster, it's gotta be done in-house. And for what I hear here, remaster from the ground up, now running on Hedgehog Engine 2. Calls the versions, run at 4, 60 FPS with the 4K option. Strong internal mandate for Sega higher-ups to improve quality of Sonic remasters from now on, so... Knock on wood. No colors ultimate and origins mishaps this time, so... <laughs> I'm gonna hold you to that. Brand new content featuring Shadow. Obviously, we got Sonic Movie 3 later this year. But yeah, literally, oh my gosh, why is everything? Oh, I knew, I, I, I was worried this is gonna happen. I was worried. Guarantee you though, next Wednesday, actually, you know what? Nintendo's probably gonna drop an announcement about Nintendo Direct tomorrow. Also, I mean, another thing that confirms this is literally another tweet, by the way. If we look at this tweet right here, King Gronk Nick is very, is very cryptic, very explicit. With his, uh, with the details in this tweet here, but listen, you guys ready for a bit of poetry? Here's a nice poem he wrote, alright? <clears throat> On the 31st, roughly, Ronin's will rise, will die stranded, have a rebirth, and Kojima will fulfill his dream. Sonic will live in the shadow of his generation, while the hills will remain silent, until the dawn when you'll need to catch the metro. Just don't be a Judas about it. Are we actually kicking off? 2024 strong right now are we actually getting info in silent hill 2 a new until dawn game and then sonic generates it mm. and then just to put the icing on top get ready for a new state of play tune in on youtube twitch or tick oh wait what but it's just streaming on tiktok now i didn't know this <laughs> so essentially 5 p.m eastern time for 40 minutes covering 15 plus games including extended looks at stellar blade and rise of the ronin plus more from talented game developers from around the world and wednesday january 31st so essentially, um, it's it's a nail in the coffin. Um, most likely, we're gonna get that Sonic Generations Ultimate. And and here's the other thing I'm worried about too. Are they gonna delist Sonic Generations just like they did with Origins? If so, that sucks. Like the fact that they delisted the original um uh, ports for the original Genesis Classic Sonic games. That was that was kind of a that was kind of a BS move right there. Like uh, you can't do that. <laughs> like that, I don't know. Like I feel like game companies don't understand game preservation like we do. Like game preservation is such an important aspect of the game industry. I feel like a lot of people don't appreciate it as much as the players do. So if Sega is planning on taking down Sonic Generations, when Sonic Generations Ultimate, whenever that comes out. Uh, now's your chance to buy the game. Thank gosh I already own the game, cause oh boy, I would be on, I would be, I would be steaming up right now if the game got taken down and I didn't own it. <laughs> I mean, hell, look at this, it's on sale for, actually it's not on sale. Oh no, wait, look at this, the Sonic the Hedgehog Ultimate Bundle, on sale for literally $23. $23, you can get all the games, so do that, so do that right now, you can do that right now. And according to Jeff Kelly, they're gonna be taking an extended look at Stellar Blade, Rise of the Ronin, I actually have 
not heard about those games at all yet, so I'm very curious to see what those are about. Just to be clear though, I most likely won't be doing a live reaction to this since I will be recovering from surgery later the day, like the day after, um, literally when this goes live, so most likely you cannot, ca if I do do a live stream, it's going to be very, very, very slim chance of happening. I would love to try and react to this, but at the same time, um, health comes first, obviously. So games that most likely will be seen, just to wrap this up, Sonic Generations Ultimate, uh, please be good. Please don't delist the original game, Sega. Honestly, that would be a tragedy if it did happen. Um, Silent Hill, um, Until Dawn, question mark. I don't know if I'm getting the right, I don't know if I'm getting the riddle right. Um, Die, Die Stranded, uh, Rebirth, Final, we'll probably have another look at Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. So yeah, it's gonna be exciting, and it would be a shame if I missed to watch this live with you guys, but let me know what you guys think about this in the comments down below. I just want to make a quick video on this, because considering the fact that I'm gonna be out for the rest of the week, I want to make a video today. Yeah, if you're a lover of all things Sonic and Nintendo, um, this is a great place to subscribe to if you want to see some more content soon. I do a lot of live streaming. I'm planning on doing some more live streaming next week. Definitely not this week, but maybe some more videos this week as well. Um, but anyways, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and dip for now. I'm gonna get this video edited and uploaded so I can have it up by the end of the day today. That being said, thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. What the heck?